the Devil RT Boxing Show. I'm your host, Mr. A. Katie Taylor defeats Christina Lani Datu to become the new 141 WBA, WBO female lightweight, cha- super lightweight champion. Now, if you tuned in to the Devil RT Boxing Show, saw the breakdown, did we not discuss that fight? It was going to be fast paced, swinging club in hands. But no jab. Katie Taylor was going to be able to see everything and pick it off. Pick it off. Now, like I said, the, the footwork was a, it caused Katie trouble because she kept Katie moving. She kept Katie moving. But the thing Katie does very well is check left hook. She was busting them out left, right, wherever she was turning, check left hooking. Why? Because there was no jab blinding Katie Taylor. Crazy, what was it? Overhand rights, wrist up taste, like we said. Christina comes in, she swings fast. The best punch she probably did land when it snapped Katie's head back was the straightaway jab and straight right hand. She landed a few um, of her of her wild right hooks, but I was like rounds nine and ten at the very end when all the pressure was wearing Katie down. She, 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 she was she gave Katie a nice black eye. Now some of it was like I said, she landed a few shots, caught Katie um, turning out. This could have been a lot of wrist action, uh, heads rubbing. She was very wild. She she really gave as as bad as Katie's face looked. It was a a, a wide a wide away victory. In how we discussed it was really no. Talent-wise, there was no threat given, but the fact that you saw how uh, strong, physical, and the, when, when the hits did land, the effect it did have on Katie. You're like, okay, this is a power. And, and, and any given moment, it seemed like Katie could be affected by those shots. That was the, the the draw within the fight. Like, oh, shit, you know, Katie, Katie is... Well, Corolla is. I got Corolla up uh, by one round. It was first two rounds, Corolla. Second two rounds, Frank. Fifth round, I gave it to Corolla, and the sixth round's pretty well right now. But anyway, you know, Frank is the second. If you're on a double RT boxing show, I know we just took a quick turn. I'm familiar with Frank. If he has this gas tank, he's going to win this fight. I think he's a better boxer than. Um, um, but he doesn't have the power, but he's a better boxer. Now, um, Katie Taylor, was she's able to pick everything off. She saw no, there was no no jab blind in her vision. And, and she was able to land. The beautiful thing was, um, she said at the end of the fight, too, that she was smart. She didn't, she didn't get invited and, and take the invitation of a, a, a war. She listened to her trainer who had her spinning and he's like, all right, start hitting on the spin out. And when she, when she start gathering and listening to that spin in there and hitting on the spin out, it was a beautiful thing to see. Cause the fact that Christina was already wild, it took her a while to gather herself after a miss. So she, her hands were already down every time Katie was spinning out. So it was, it was perfectly open the trainer saw it, called for it. It was as as easy as you saw the strategy. Like I said, it was easy. You saw it happening, but it's still Christina with that movement and just the velocity and the swings. You saw she was she was physically wearing Katie down, mentally wearing Katie down, but she just didn't have a jab. I'm saying if she had a jab, that fight would have been different. Cause like I said, she landed a few shots throughout the match, and they had that overhand right had effect on Katie. But with no jab, it was easy work for Katie. Picked off everything. Picked off everything. Beautiful footwork. Good turning. Um, g- good slipping of punches. Like, even like I said, even though she got that shiner on her eye. Her defense was on point. She was spinning out, slipping punch. It just, Christina's a fast, athletic woman that we talked about. This is the most athletic opponent Katie Taylor has faced. 
Katie's just lucky the girl had no jab. Again, victorious two division champion Katie Taylor, the new WBO super lightweight female champion, defeating Christina Ladadatu. I don't know the scorecards. I had it on mute. Like I do this Corolla fight, but very impressive. Thank you for tuning in.